Hello everyone, welcome to ProVisual Tutorials. In this video, I will show you how you can easily set up and showcase your design using ProVisual and our 3D models. Let's go to the 3D Models section and choose an object for our tutorial. The library contains a variety of high-quality 3D models, and it's updated weekly. This t-shirt caught my attention. Let's open it and take a closer look. Looks impressive. Let's create a new project. So here's how our 3D model looks. I really like how detailed and realistic this t-shirt is. Let's take a look and pick a suitable material for our t-shirt. This material suits us. Let's slightly increase the texture size. Okay, next, let's adjust the color. You can either select or customize the color using the color palette. Or enter the color code manually, like this. Let's also change the color of the collar. Impressive. Next, let's set the color for the inner part of the t-shirt. Look at this attention to detail. It's just mind-blowing. Let's change the colors of the collar stand. And collar seams. Wow, all these details on the seams. It looks fantastic. I think this deserves a like on this video. Let's change the color. Also, let's change the color of the shirt seams. Excellent. All right. We've adjusted the materials and colors on our 3D t-shirt model. Next, let's add a design to our t-shirt. To add a design, you can click on the Add Design button on the Design Layers panel, or you can download a UV map and create your design in another editor. I've already prepared some images for our t-shirt. Let's add a design element to the t-shirt. In the opened window, we see an editor where we can move and modify our design. Note that the position of our design is displayed in real time on the 3D model in the left window. Okay, looks cool. Now let's add another design element. To do this, click on the Add Image icon and then select the image. Scaling it, and then placing our element in the desired position based on the UV map. You can change the opacity of your image or adjust the fill color like this. Now let's add a design to the sleeve of our t-shirt. Reducing the size slightly. Moving it a bit so our design looks great on the t-shirt.
Okay, now let's save our design. It looks fantastic. Now let's add a design to the back of the t-shirt. To edit the layer and add new design elements, click on the Edit Design. Look at how this design fits into the folds of the t-shirt. Looks so natural. Let's save the design again. Now let's change the material of our design. In Provisual, it's super easy. Let's go to the Materials Library and find an interesting and appropriate material for this design. See how this material reflects the light. This is excellent. Great! We're almost done with the t-shirt design. We just need to add a nice background. Let's see what types of pre-made backgrounds we have available. We can choose a solid fill as the background. Or we can go for a gradient fill. Here, we can select the desired colors and also choose the direction of the fill, linear or radial. You can also pick one of the pre-designed backgrounds that we've prepared for you. Or add your own image. Let's add one. Excellent. Let's save our project. You can rotate the 3D model to see how the design looks in motion. You can also turn on moving lights. After you've finished your design, you can share it by clicking the share button. Share it with colleagues, friends, or clients. And that's the end of our tutorial on creating a t-shirt design. We hope this has been helpful for you. See you in the upcoming tutorials!